Will Simmer. We're going to talk to you about swimwear. So, shall we have a look at, so if you're somebody who's uh, more of an oval shape, so a rounder shape, then, then what you want to look for is something like this costume here. Um, this has got detail down the front, so it's got a pattern, so that disguises. And it's also got ruching as well, so ruching again is really good for disguising tummies. So if you're someone that's rounder, then this kind of style, with the detail at the front, the, the disguising detail, if you like the florals and the, and the pattern on it, and also the ruching, and cup size would be preferable, um, then that would work really well for you. And this one is from, let's have a look, it's Pour Moi, that one. So nice one for the ovals or rounds amongst you. Now I've got this one from Fig Leaves. Um, particularly like it because it's quite plain and striped down the bottom and then a bit more detailing across the best. So it will work on somebody like me. Haven't even tried it on yet, but I shall be trying it on. <laughs> Just because, like I say, it's plainer down the bottom, you've got the detail on the best, and because I'm quite full busted, it's got the underwiring and the cup, cup size as well. So there's quite a few makes these days. You know, you can go to Bravismo, you can go to Fig Leaves, Ample Bosom, um, and they do the cup sizes. If you've got a, a larger best that needs support, yeah, much, you can yeah. do that. I particularly like this one because you've got adjustable straps. My shoulders mm. are quite narrow, um, I don't want a halter neck, um, but I could take the straps off. It's got a lot of support and then I won't get strap lines. I see a lot of brides these days and they get the strap lines. So if you're gonna yeah. need to be wearing a strapless <laughs> dress in the near future, um, something like that's great. And just remember to de detach the strap. Okay, if you're somebody that's more of a sort of an athletic shape, so if you're broader on the top and very narrow down beneath, you can wear some of the styles that have got boy shorts with them. So I'm going to show you an example of that. So this is a uh, very sort of floral and patterned one. So you've got a cup at the top, so you can see they're just a little sort of uh, triangular cups, okay? And then down beneath, you can either go for your little, you know, bikini, but if you want to balance out your shape, then actually if you add a short, so this comes with a short that actually ma matches, um, you, it will balance out your top half, where you're wider on the top half, this will give you a little bit more breadth um, at the bottom half and so balance. And this is really great because you can mix and match it. So you can have the shorts one day and then when you want to go in the water or you want a bit more sun on your body or whatever, you've got the, the little bikini briefs as well. So really nice and very vibrant pattern. So if you fancy a bit of pattern and, and sunshiny colors on your holiday, then this one could be for you. Where's it from? Where Let me just check. Yeah. Um, this one is actually next, so okay. next beachwear, and it all mixes and matches. Lovely. Fantastic. Okay, moving on. We've got this one. This one's from Fig Leaves as well. Um, now, this one, as I say, wouldn't be suitable for somebody that's got narrower shoulders. Mm. So, not for your apples, not for your, your rounder ladies. It'll round you off with that halter neck. Not for me, narrow, narrow shoulders. This one would work on a uh, a rectangular shape with a full bust, full bust yeah. or also the ladies that I'm now calling strawberries so they've got really lovely wide shoulders yeah. they body goes away you know narrow hips but they've got a nice full bust so that sort of shape would work really nicely on them perfect Okay, and then if you're somebody that's sort of very lean um, and you want to add some curves, then actually your well, choice is yours really. Um, if you go for things like um, dots and florals and squiggles and things that have got lots of interest going on, that can work really, really well. So let me show you this one here. So this is black and white polka dot and then it's got lots of frilly details so you're adding extra interest to the top and sort of adding curves and this one's quite padded as well so again it's going to give you a little bit more definition a little bit more curve at the top this is by Lipsy and it comes with its own little um, bikini briefs here that have got a little roll top as well um, if there was even more interest on the bottom that would be even better um, you'd have you know even more frills perhaps or some detailing that makes the bottom really happen as well so you're adding curves to your lovely um, straighter shape and then if you are a full hourglass and you've got the nice curves I found this bikini in Bravissimo so this one is a is it a Freya one it's yeah, a Freya, Freya one okay so if you get on with the Freya bras you probably get on with the Freya bikinis as well um, so you've got the kept size in there that one's pretty huge <laughs> <laughs> just because you've got nice assets Beth <laughs> thought I can't possibly fit in there but I do um, love the color of that one too 
And then what we were talking about before, Kay, yeah, was the high leg true. as well. Yeah. So if you find that you're shorter on the leg, go for a nice high leg and it'll just elongate the leg for you. Yeah. And I, I do have short stumpy legs. So I like it. <laughs> Me too. We've bikini. got that in common. <laughs> <laughs> We've got that in common. Mm. Yes, mm. yes, <laughs> yes. Yeah, a high leg on the briefs. Perfect. So you should be beach ready so you now know which shapes of uh, swimwear to choose and we've given you a variety of places to go and find them in as well good luck have a fabulous holiday